Just got in from work, now about to feed the dogs. I'm gonna feed the dogs a raw enhanced formulated food. Just place you there. This is what I've chosen. It's Nutriment Raw Enhanced Formulated Food. It's 85% muscle meat, organs, and bone. Also, it's got 15% vegetables, fruits, and oils in it. Dogs are hungry again and it's time to feed them. This morning I'm going to feed the whole prey diet. If you don't like gory images, look away now. The whole prey diet literally consists of an entire animal. Now I can only feed this to one of my dogs and that's Gonzo because he will eat the whole thing. Benny doesn't like the wrapper it comes in and he can't quite work out how to get it off. Right, we'll get that off screen, that's pretty horrible. Also, I'm going to feed the prey model diet. This is Paleo Ridge, where we can see that there. The whole prey, the prey model diet just consists of 80-10-10, 80% muscle meat, 10% bone, 10% offal. I'll show it to you. Let's try tackle this question. Are completes complete? Well, I guess they're as complete as they can be. Uh, the prey model pre-mades include all the bits and bobs of it, all the animals, so that's an absolute bonus. The enhanced pre-mades include oils, fruits, vegetables, and all those types of things to make sure that the dog's getting all the vital nutrients they need. Also, the whole prey diet, well, you're including the entire animal, so uh, that's what they would have eaten. And I suppose that is as complete as it can be. Uh, one of the things I'm really going to try and push is that you have to make a complete diet which is best for your dog. For example, one of my dogs, Gonzo, does really well with vegetables. If he doesn't have vegetables, he gets blood in his stools. However, if he does, he gets the healthy fibre and he has no blood in his stools and he does really well with vegetables. However, Benny, on the other hand, does not need vegetables at all. He does really, really well on a whole prey diet and that's what I tend to feed him because that's what makes him thrive. I'd like to try and push this, this opinion home and I'd hope that people would try and make a complete diet for your dog. I mean, if your dog's got sensitivities or, aller or is allergic to different types of things, then don't feed those things. Uh, it's not any less complete because you're doing what's best for your dog. We will do as best as we can and learning what our dogs are sensitive to and what they may be allergic to is really, really vital. And you need, need to be really watching your dog when they're eating different types of foods to see their reaction to these foods. Uh, for example, chicken and beef are really high allergens uh, and dogs tend to have a lot of sensitivities to these. So if you are feeding those foods and your dog's reacting to them, then perhaps avoid those foods for greater health. If there's one thing that I would definitely add into everyone's diet, and that's and that would be fish uh, in the form of sardines, mackerel, sprats, anything that's really oily to get those omega frees into the dog. You can also use supplements if your dog doesn't like eating fish, so you can use squirt on bottles to get the uh, salmon oil or different types of oils onto the food to make sure they're getting the correct DHA and EPA for health, bone, joints and brain function, all these types of things. You can also add in certain types of vegetables to make sure they're getting the key nutrients that they need but I think we'll talk about that on another video because that's quite a large subject and I don't want to run on too much today. So all in all, do what's best for your dog. Learn your dog, uh, make sure you're watching them when they're eating to see if they have any reactions to certain types of foods. Reactions can be instant or reactions can be over time as long as you're feeding a complete so it does contain all offal bone and meat also vegetables if you're using the enhanced completes and they work really well for your dog i've also experienced dogs that do really well on different types of pre-made some dogs do really well on nutriment let's say and some dogs do really poorly on nutriment some dogs do extremely well on paleo ridge and whole prey uh, pre-made and some just do not so feed what works for you. Feed what works for your dog and helps them become really healthy, vibrant, and skip around like we all like to see them. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Please do like, share, and leave a comment below if you have any questions for me. I like to try and create as many videos as I can, and the feedback off you guys is next to none. I know where I can improve. I know which I could do better. These are all the types of things that I really would like to know with my videos so I can do the best for you guys. Thank you all for watching. See you later.